Stone, good morning over there. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Stone. Okay, yeah. so Stone, can you please tell me Can you please tell me your current grade? Uh, I'm in 11th grade now. Yes, the grade you're in right now. Yeah. Uh, I'm in 11th grade now. Oh, 11th grade. Okay, excellent. What grade are you applying to in America? Uh, 11th grade. Excellent. Stone, what is your date of birth? Your birth date? Uh, my birthday is... Uh, August 16th. October 16th. Uh, what year? Uh, 1989. Okay, so okay. let me make sure. Your birthday is October 16? Uh, 17. Okay, your birthday is October 17, 1998. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Good. Stone, have you taken any exams such as the SLAP, TOEFL, SSAT, any of those? No. Do you plan on taking them? Yeah. No I'm plans? Not, yeah. Okay. I'm not take them. Okay. All right, Stone. So first, I'm going to ask you a few questions to get to know you. Uh, then I'll ask plan. I'll ask you plans about your future, and then I want to get to know what uh, what kind of school you're looking for. Okay. 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 Uh, so first, tell me what is your favorite. Tell, tell me what is your favorite subject in your current school. Uh, maybe math and uh, history. Math and history. Why do you like those subjects? Uh, uh I think math is a magical subject and uh, is geography, thinking paths, and uh, ability expression is uh, meaningful. So I think I love my math. Good. Good, excellent. Uh, tell me what are the subjects that you do not like? Maybe... Uh, maybe Chinese. Okay, tell me why you don't like Chinese. Uh, I think Chinese is very, very uh, difficult. Yeah? Uh, what, what, part about the, what part about the subject do you find difficult? Maybe writing. The writing part. Okay. Yeah. Excellent. All right, Stone. So you want to come to America. Tell me why do you want to come to America to study? Uh, because I think America is a divisive country. And uh, the students come from all over the world. I can learn from more difficult culture within China. Good. Good. So tell me, what do you know about... Tell me, what are some of the things that you know about America? Uh, I think America is wonderful. It's uh, the biggest country in the world. Mm -hmm. uh, their traditional uh, their education is very good. So I think I want to go to the America for study. Good. Good. Excellent, Stone. So tell me... What do you do on your free time? Uh, maybe playing basketball or soccer. Basketball or soccer? Yeah. Okay, how often do you play how often do you play those? Uh sorry. How often? How often do you play basketball and soccer? Or soccer? Uh, we, twice a week. Two times a week, okay. And do you play with friends or is it with the uh, organized? Is it with the school? Uh, with my friend and all my parents. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, excellent. That's interesting. All right, Stone. Uh, moving on. Tell me what is challenging in your daily life. Mm, challenging. Yes. Uh, in daily life. Yes. Uh, maybe I think. Uh, I think my English is a challenge in my speaking skill. I, wa I want to improve that. It's a difficult for me. 
Okay, good. So, uh, how are you improving your English? Maybe uh, listening some music and uh, watch mu movies in English. Okay, movies and music. music. Okay, now you say this is challenging for your daily life. Are you interacting with English speakers regularly every day, or how often do you interact with English speakers? Uh, maybe every day. Every day, good. Uh, where in the are you, where in school in cof in the in coffee shops or how uh, where are you interacting with these English speakers? At school. Yeah. Okay. So, t uh, is is this? Uh, tell me more about the school again. I forgot to ask you about that. Uh. Sorry, I. Is uh, it is it international school? No, it's a. Uh, it's a local school. Local school. Okay. Are there English speakers at your school, or is it all Chinese? All Chinese. All Chinese. Okay. So English class then. English class. We have English class. You have English class. Okay. And that's where you get most of your interactions. That's where you are able to uh, practice your English. Yeah. Good. Where else are you able to practice your English? Sorry. Uh, so you practice your English in class time, right, at school? Uh -huh. What about What about every day? What about uh, in... What about in other places? Just in class. Just in class, okay. Okay, excellent. All right, so Stone, you are in grade 11 now. You are soon entering college, so I want to know, what are your plans? Uh, sorry. Uh, what, what do you see yourself doing after, after high school? Do you have college plans or... Are you going? Are you, what do you uh, plan on college. doing? College. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Uh, tell me, what have you researched for college? Do you know where you want to go? Uh, I want to go. Uh, maybe Boston. Boston. Excellent. Okay. Do you have any idea what you want to study? Computer. Computer. Boston. Okay. Now Boston has many universities. Which universities do you know? Um, MIT, good. Harvard, and uh, Boston College, and so on. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, excellent. Do you have any preference? Do you have uh, any any of those schools you like better, the best? Best, I think, is MIT. Okay. Good. Good. Excellent, Stone. Uh, so, you said you want to learn more about computer. Why do you like computers? Hello, Stone. You want to study computers, right? Programming? Yeah, I want to study computers. Okay, good. Uh, do you have classes, computer classes right now? Or why, why is uh, computers interesting to you? Uh, in my free time, I often play computer games. I I not think I want to make computer games for people, and I think I can bring him interesting and funny. Okay, excellent. Okay, excellent. So you want to create the program for computer games? Yeah. Yeah, excellent. Okay, Stone. Tell me. Who in your life is the most important? My parents. Okay, good. Tell me why they are most important. Uh, because in my uh, childhood, they, uh, they exercised my ability to solve the problem by myself. Uh, and I think they bring me a lot in my childhood. So I think they are important person in my life. Okay. okay, very good. Stone, can you recommend a good book to me? A uh, book? Yeah. Uh, uh, maybe uh, Stephen Jobs' biography. 
never seen. Steve Jobs biography. Yeah. Okay, what what is interesting to you about Steve Jobs? Uh, I think Steve Jobs is wonderful, and uh, although he was ill, but he never gave up. He uh, encouraged their uh, emphasize and uh, make some new technology, and because of his offer, the uh, Apple will succeed. Okay, good. Good. Excellent, Stone. So I want to ask you now, uh, what is most important to you when deciding on a school? Deciding? Yeah, so what, what is it about the high school? What is your expectation uh, for studying in America? The school? Do you want a big school? you want a small school? Uh, what is it about the school that that you want? Maybe a uh, small school. Okay, small school. Do you have preference for city or suburbs or country? Uh, city. City, like Boston. Yeah. You prefer Boston area? East Coast then, Boston. Okay, good. All right, excellent, Stone. Um, moving on now. Uh, last part is I need you to do a reading for me, and then I will ask you questions on the reading. Okay. Okay. So hang on a second. Let me pull up the reading. Okay, Stone, do you see? Yeah, I see. Okay, can you go ahead and read out loud for me, please? Okay. Uh, what would you do if you ran into a van while hanging in the woods in Canada? Chances are that you wouldn't have to do anything. There is usually a goal of people when they meet people in the woods. Bear attracts a very arrow. But what if? Bear didn't run away, and interest and and impress the bear start to avoid you. What would you do? Would you run away? The would be the wrong thing to do. You shouldn't never run away because the mad case the bear to think that you are some kids of prey, and uh, you can run faster than the bear. Than a bear, some bears can run faster than a real horse. Good. So, so tell me, have you ever been camping before? No. Have you ever encountered a bear? Have you ever seen a bear? No, no. Okay, so based on this passage, if you happen to see a bear, what should you do? Uh, you should, you should never run away. And uh, uh, I think I can't run faster than a bear. Good. So what is it about bears? What is it about bears that you should not run away? Uh, because some bears can run faster than a real horse. Okay, so they're really fast, huh? Very good. Okay, good. Uh, Stone, that's all I have for the formal part of this. Please stay on the line. I will stop the recording, okay? Okay. Okay, hang on a second.